It was definitely very interesting when Montefiore reached out to explain my story through dance. I went to Mima, who's a choreographer with the Washington Ballet, and asked if he could help me tell my story. We all started this by basically just sitting down together, and he wrote down little things that stuck out throughout my treatment. Anytime you're working with a choreographer, it's very exciting because it's a new piece. Telling my story was something I had never done before. Being able to share that journey without words. The beginning of the solo is kind of just way before any of the diagnosis. Just me like living my everyday life. And then throughout the piece, you notice that all my attention starts going to my leg. Feeling that pain within the leg. But somehow you see me keep going. Somehow I could be in pain and dancing just helped me forget about that pain. And then there's this moment where the treatment starts and you notice that the attention goes to the hair. And I'm shocked that it's all falling out. It started to become real, like this is what you're gonna go through, this is no joke. Basically, when I was in the hospital, I had problems walking like even five feet. It was hard even just to make it to the bathroom. So there's this reaching moment where and then I just kind of collapse because I don't have the energy to keep going. And then finally at the end of the piece um, is a tribute to one of the patients that I met throughout treatment who's now an angel, and I say he's my guardian angel. Reaching up to him, helping me continue. All cancer survivors, all of those that have lost their lives to cancer, those that are fighting, I just want to be for them.